Hello, and welcome back to Nightly Nerds. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. And we're playing... Monster Hunter World. Yay! And I gotta remember to mute my phone one moment. <laughs> I don't want that going off like it has so we played many this, times. We played this last week. We're picking it up again. And in between then, I got like crazy sick. All right. So this is something I for, I, I didn't discover oh, until, I was, piggly wiggly. <laughs> until I was playing at home. His, this is Poogie. He's a reoccurring Monster Hunter character. Aww. Is he wearing a sweater? Is that... It's a sweater. Oh, okay. And I pet him. Aww. And if I pet him, everything, he gets happier and happier. Aww. And then, once, since I pet him successfully, I can carry him around. Aww. Well, isn't that just too cute? Yep. And so anywhere you put him down to, he takes a nap. Aww. <laughs> Anyways. All right, yeah. so let me talk to some people here, you know, fill some people on what's been going on with the... So I've got a throat lozenge, people, just letting you know. And he wants us to capture or slay monsters, so he gives us optional quests, I believe. Sometimes. Sometimes. Hello. Oh, hello. Grimalkins, which are little, like, cat friends in the wild. Ah. I just gotta make sure to talk to everyone because sometimes you can miss out on important equipment. That helps. I appreciate everybody who's been contributing to our comments lately. I enjoy I, responding. I just love say that. popping in and reading them, responding when I can. <laughs> it's great. I watch it like a hawk, so Ginger doesn't always get a chance. Yeah, because rather than bog our, our channel down with stuff I watch at home, I'm on my own channel. Or my own account. Oh, you're just saying I bog the channel down when yeah. I watch stuff on there. On occasion, yes. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I always forget to switch back to my personal account, and so I just start watching stuff, and I'm like, oh wait, I'm still logged into <laughs> Nightly Nerds, and we have a ton of new liked videos. <laughs> and it affects our feed. It does, but who cares? I don't. All right, just want to clear out these exclamation marks. There's really nothing important. It's like small things here and there, like, I'm the engineer of the airship, blah, 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 blah. Come talk to me if blah, 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 blah. Pretty much, it's... Things you could know if you really wanted to, like uh -huh. if you played this on your own, but for the most case, for the most part, it's talking to him, the meow skiller chef, and he gives you little quests of like, hey, uh, go out on these hunts and find these things for me, and I will give you more stuff on the menu. This dude is awesome. I love that whole little sequence when they cook for you. Oh yeah, yeah. So if you do quests for him, you get more and more things that cook for you. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. So yeah, so now it's like, go find 20 gourmet shroom caps, which is optional stuff. Don't have to do it. Side I, quest. I will do it on off-camera stuff. Or you'll just do it as we play and have <laughs> to get done. But not like, go look for them. Well, no, I actually have to like, I would have to go here, ah. post a quest, pick an optional quest. Oh, okay. So it'll be like, hey, go find these caps. Interesting. I also think they're like good things you can just kind of find as you're going. I wish. The quest. I really do wish. Um, but yeah, I learned a lot on my own little playthroughs. Like, a lot. A lot? Um, you know what? Actually, uh, we'll talk to the commander. There's some things I want to... Demacia! Demacia! So, I learned a few interesting little things. So, instead of straight out killing monsters, we can capture them. Ah! So, I need to buy some trap tools... So when we get out into the into the world, what do I have? I don't know. Okay. Either way, let's let's start with a mission, and I can go gather some supplies. Yay! Damasia. Done well. Nice right, so we're clearing out the camp. I need to come through, and now we're finally ready. All right, Hunter, the Pookie Pookie hunt is on. Once you've hunted the target, the scholars will get uh, will be able to get a closer look at the evidence you found. I cannot stress enough how vital taking on the Pookie Pookie is the for the commission. All right. So that was the one that the spit the acid at us or yes. whatever? Partner, spit the poison me. that looks like a weird peacock lizard dragon. Hey yeah, okay. All right. And then we decided on the last episode that I'm going to try out the switch axe so you at home as well as Tote here can see what it looks like. Yay. Well, we did test it. Yeah, just a little hey bit. There, but I also learned how to play it a little bit Okay. Better. I really enjoyed the dual machetes, though. I, I, I play them quite consistently at home. Okay. 
Well, not as consistently as the bow. The bow is just too much fun. All right. So we go on the Puke Puke hunt. And we'll go... I need to find sleep herb. Yeah, so I was out and... Uh, well, out. I went out and helped my sister watch the kids and stuff. And, like, we're planning... I had to, I wanted to like, help redo her bathroom and stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, I think her one of her daughters was sick. She had a little bit of a rattly cough. Yeah. And, and she gave it to me. Yeah. That's the one thing. That's the one frustrating thing is like kids, kids will get like a strong version of some kind of sickness. And then the parents being like not as strong of immune system anymore. Just get it 10 times worse. Well, I'm not even a parent though. Come on. But I mean, adults. Yeah, I'm an adult or whatever. Yeah. So I picked it up and like it was like Saturday. I had a bit of a cough and I thought it was because I helped my mom put some... Uh, like a bunch of boxes in the garage. So I thought it was dust or something got into me. Yeah. By the end of the night, I was just hacking my brains out. <laughs> That'll do it. And then I think it was by uh, about Tuesday, I thought it was done. And it kind of went away. And well, what it did is it just kind of went from like my throat. And it just settled down inside my chest. Yeah. And it kind of became like a dry cough. Oh, yeah. So oh. I had to get a humidifier and all this stuff. to it's get. It's raining. Oh, it's driving me nuts. It's I even coughed up a little blood because I was coughing so hard and nothing was happening. Yeah. Oh, it's driving me insane. Uh, I don't have the chef's choice platter available yet. Ugh. All right. Eat some food to get some stamina. As well I think as I'm good now. I'm not contagious or anything anymore because like, the fever and all that stuff it was only for a couple of days. Yeah. It's just the cough just didn't wouldn't, wouldn't go away. I think now I just have bronchitis. Yeah. All right. So I need to set that to auto craft. As well as just inflammation that of the bronchial tube. Oh, Mr. Science Man. Mm -hmm. Hopefully I don't get pneumonia, because I've had pneumonia like three times already in my life. And so once you have it once, you're always like susceptible to it again. Yeah. I don't want to get it again. Uh, so I've been like avoiding skills. laying down and stuff. Trying to sleep like in a recliner or something instead of yeah. on a bed. It's so rainy. All right, so now we need to... I know where the pookie pookie tends to go. Mm, the pookie pookie. But I need to find... Sounds like some kind of dish. A little bit. But I need to find... Uh, like, what are you eating? Oh, we went and got some pookie pookie. Pookie pookie. I need to find some uh, sleep herb as well as some parish rooms, but I know where the parish rooms are. I don't exactly know where the sleep herb is. Sleep herb. Yeah, like, there, it was really unoriginal, but, like, all the herbs are labeled herb, sleep herb, antidote herb. Oh, just, like, snow whatever herb. Whatever they are, herb. Yeah, pretty much. Eh, it works. It does. I have uh, to give them some kind of crazy name. Well, they well could. really, all the crazy names we have for plants, <clears throat> you know, are usually that, that is just in Latin. So, if you, like, look up the, or Greek or something, you know what I mean? Or whatever language it was originally founded in. So it'll literally be like, oh, this is a, you know, crazy cool sounding name. But if you look up the definition of that word, it just means like sleep herb. You know, or sleeping plant or something like that. Yeah. Deadly nightshade. So it was also very interesting to learn that, um, so the big, the big enemies, unless you invade their nest, don't care about you. Huh. Like, um, yeah, so like the big great jaggers we fought, uh -huh. he doesn't actually attack you. It's only the little jaggerses who hunt in packs. Ah. But need to carve us some enemies so nothing gets a waste. And then I'm going to use the map real quick, which I was trying to do before I got attacked. Okay, let's zoom in a little bit. Speaking of carving up enemies, uh, was that Red Dead Redemption? You no, know, because you can... Yeah. Hunt and stuff, and you can skin things in that. This got pushed back to October. Did it? That's sad. There's actually a release date on it now, though. Oh, I don't have the upper floor. But that is sad. I wanted to play that game so bad. What's the release date on it? It's like uh, October 26th or something, well, 2018. We need, we need to get it. We need to oh, I'm totally going to get it, whether we play it or not. I'm we, getting it. We need to play all the all the Red Deads and, you know, have some fun. Well, I have Red Dead uh, Revolver. Yeah. The one the one that came out that was like supposed to be redemption but they didn't quite finish it. Yeah. Didn't your uh, didn't doesn't your brother have the other one? I have it as well. I just let my cousin use it. Oh. So I have Red Dead Redemption as well. Red Dead Redemption. 
I love those games. Even even Red Dead Revolver, it's cheesy, but it's like fun cheesy. Mm-hmm. It's like a spaghetti western kind of thing going on. Way over the top, but fun. But you know me in westerns. I don't I care know. for them. I love westerns. All right, I'm also going to grab this camp while I'm at it, so future hunts get a little easier. But they had, so there's like hidden camps out in the wild. Don't you go with trying to attack I can just sit down and watch me. a John Wayne movie, dude. That's how I am. <laughs> Ugh, I, I mean, here. not just John Wayne. There's other guys, too, but he's like the go-to. Yeah. Everyone's go-to. All right. So this is a little hidden camp. I got to do a quest for it to, um, to set up base. I love the Man Without a Name series, too, though. So, the man with no name or whatever. <coughs> I remember. The, the Clint Eastwoods. Yeah. Didn't that spurn the... Spurn like the uh, what is it the idea for the song of a horse with no name? I have no name. I have no idea. But uh, you have no name. I have no name. You have no name. I have no name. No, I have no idea. <laughs> um, I know that those are really just re. Uh, they're just copies of Japanese films. Yeah. What I if I think. But uh, so I remember playing the the card game Munchkin for those who. Um, curious what yeah. it is without mentioning just just the name on its own. Um, so there's the the Western version of the Munchkin game, which is a, a spoof game that makes fun of a lot of things. Um, so there's a card in there for a companion of a horse. It's the horse with no name, and yeah. you can lose the the horse by saying a horse with no name. Your horse doesn't have a name. Don't don't mention it. Oh god. So you can lose it by by mentioning that you have a horse. He's going to say, like, I have this, when you're trying to tally up your score. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be dumb. I wanted to catch it. I just don't know where the sleep herb is. I also need to go up top for thunderbugs anyways. Doodly, 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 doodly. Yeah, yeah, I know. We're, uh, we're, we're, getting, we're getting close on time, so we'll probably have to wrap this up in a moment while I... Uh, while you look for sleep herb, stupidly try to find this. But before we cut this off camera, for those who are, you know, happen to be playing along with me, um, I'll show you where a neat little, uh, neat little camp is for a much later quest. I'm pretty sure that by the time this episode airs, we'll hey, be, hey. be past this. But okay. Hey, I want to treat everyone equal. Okay. There's the thunderbug, so I can make at least one shock trap. Thunderbug. Do 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 boo da boo da boo boo. It's gonna be stuck in my head now because I mentioned it. That's not my fault. No, it's always your fault. You and songs, your fault. Okay. It's the way the cookie crumbles. It is actually pretty hard to see the screen with it being dark and the light on. <laughs> oh, I asked if you wanted to turn the light off. Well, I, I didn't think it would, it would be raining on our first freaking mission. <laughs> okay, so then we go up over here. Oh, my ears just popped. I can hear everything now. Oh, I can hear clearly now. My ears have popped. I can see all obstacles in the way. Yes, we can. Yeah, you know what? So on the next episode, I'm just going to go straight after the Pookie Pookie. Alrighty. And we will capture stuff after that because it will become a lot easier to get Sleep Herb. Alrighty. So we will catch you guys next time. This has been our playthrough of Monster Hunter World. And as always, I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. See you then. Hey, did you like that video? Well, if you did, click the box on the right for another. Click the box on the left for a playlist. Of course, you could always just subscribe by clicking the link in the middle. Come find us on social media. There are links in the description below. Don't be afraid to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. See you then. Bye.